What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how I record my drums using GarageBand. So before we get started, if you're new to this channel, if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button, return it, like, share, comment. Let's get right into it. All right, so the first thing I want to do is I want to go ahead and open up some tracks, some audio tracks. So with my setup, we got eight channels. So first thing I wanna do is put in, I have eight inputs. So I'm gonna get in all the inputs. We do that first. All right, so now we got all eight inputs in. Now I wanna go to, we're gonna go to track, and then we're gonna go to configure track header. So that way we can enable, record enable, so that way all, all the channels can be ready to record. And then we wanna click them all on, then we'll be ready to go. So now, it's time to record. Let's go!
tracks I just finished playing to was the 9-4 Groove made by Damani Rhodes on the Drum Tracks app. If you haven't seen the Drum Tracks app, go check it out because they got lessons on there. You got drumless tracks and a lot that you can practice with and take your drumming to the next level. The second track I played was Finesse made by Carla McCuller on ShedTracks.com. Shout out to Damani Rhodes and shout out to Colin McCullough for creating drumless tracks for us fellow musicians to practice and take our craft to the next level. If y'all want to connect with me, hit me on the social medias or you can hit me on the comment section. Um, hit me on IG, Drums and Dreads. I'm on TikTok now, Drums and Dreads, and Facebook, Kenny Day. If you have any questions for me, just hit me on my socials and I will answer the questions to the best of my abilities. And another special announcement. Check out my gamer channel. K-Day the Gamer. Doing some video game content. So excited that I got that channel started. So check it out. Hope y'all enjoy watching my video. Stay tuned because I got some more content on the way. Peace out. <laughs>